go into man we're on the we're on our international tip huh we are on our international tip let's let's uh let's go into the uk shout out to i know we got some people watching from the uk i want to talk about that 116 dollars a gram yep shout out to japan shout out to nihon i love japan um okay so we are starting to see people start to crack down, it looks like, in the UK on the we grows. I know we got some people watching from the UK. What's it like? Let us know down in the chat. Are people getting cracked down on? Is it is there more enforcement? Is it is it still the same? Is it, you know, let me know. I would love to hear your guys' thoughts down below in the uh, live stream or in the chat. So let's go over this. This is by AJ Harrington. Shout out to AJ Harrington from High Times. So police in the United Kingdom arrest more than 1,000 individuals and confiscated more than 180,000 plants in a recent push to crack down on illicit cultivations. The eradication campaign dubbed Operation Millie by UK law enforcement officials was carried out throughout the month of June and involved every police force in England, Scotland, and Wales, according to media reports. Uh, so Steve Jubb, the National Police Chiefs Council, NPCC, led for serious and organized crime, told reporters that the operation has successfully disrupted a significant amount of criminal activity. Oh, successfully, yeah, bro. Good luck, dude. It's, it's, come on. Come on, we know the truth, bro. This is like the, this is the Hydra effect, dude. You're gonna like try to, <laughs> it's, it's, anyway, we know. So Operation Millie was the largest uh, eradication to date with more than 11,000 police officers across the UK participating in a month long drive. That's cool, that's cool. That's kind of shitty. Sorry, sorry for all the people that got caught up. Anybody? I thought we got some people from UK, bro. Who from the UK? I mean, I guess you don't want to like comment if it's it's too for some reason you're worried about that. But approximately forty other weapons, six hundred fifty thousand dollars in cash. Ha see, plant sees at one hundred thirty million. And these, yeah, but great point by AJ. These prices, the estimates for the pricing is almost always exaggerated heavily, like. They'll, they'll, they'll call like $150,000 worth of weed and go, we just got a million dollars. It's like, dude, no, you didn't, bro. Like, stop with stop with the cap. Like, you guys are you guys are such cloud chasers, honestly. Some of these, <laughs> some of these police officers, I mean, some of these, these uh, you know, law enforcement agencies. Um, so guys, I mean, we I mean, if you if you haven't seen the uh the documentary I did, I mean not the the kind of video essay I did on the Albania mafia, you know, it talks about the UK. Um yeah, I don't. Yeah, please call for drug decriminalization. Yeah. Anyway, I can't wait. I'm gonna be going out to the UK here soon. Uh, this this coming year, I would love for anybody from the UK to hit me up. You know, we're definitely looking to do uh, some content over there. Um, I got a lot of family over there. I'm a you know I love I love uh, the UK. Got family in Manchester, Leeds, London. Yeah, so some cool stuff there for sure we gotta definitely figure some of that out okay um let's go over let's go over this i just saw somebody sent me this to me um shout out 